Hey, what's up, you guys? Coach Joey coming in, uh, sitting in the parking lot of the gym. I wanted to come in with a little bit of a message for today. Um, so we're going to do it a little bit different. I started reading a book this week uh, by Napoleon Hill called Outwitting the Devil. A uh, really good book. Uh, I'm not too deep into it yet, maybe about a third or a quarter of the way into it. But there was a, uh, a great, uh, maybe part of a paragraph or, or description, maybe short story, whatever you like to refer to it as. Um, I want to read it to you and then we'll talk about it a little bit. So it starts off, it says, I had a conversation with just such a young man. I am 30 years old, he said, and I have no marketable skills or prospects. He had a million excuses for not taking action to change a situation. I pointed out that unless he took action, nothing would change. Unless you make an effort to change things, I said, in a year's time, the only difference will be that you are 31 years old with no marketable skills or prospects. Does this pattern sound familiar to you, either for yourself or someone you care for? How do you break that paralysis? Um, so that to me is a very, very, very valid, I guess, perception that you can look at life. So, um, you know, you, meet, you come across a lot of things, myself included, in life where you're, you're not happy about a situation, but you're scared to make the change because um, we've talked about this in the past, kind of paralysis by analysis. And when most people are sitting down trying to see if something's going to be a good decision or a bad decision, usually they get clouded by just the negativity of the things that could, you know, stop them or, or things that could be bad for them making a change. So what you have to do um, if you're unhappy in a situation is, is it's a simple answer is you just have to make a change. Um, if not, you're going to be in the same unhappy situation. That's guaranteed. Nothing will change. Now, if you make a change, is it possible that things could get worse? Absolutely. Um, you can make a change. And things may be going the wrong direction, but the point is they go in another direction. And then from there, you could figure it out how to make things better. Or they can get better for you. Um, you know, people do this when they talk about going back to school. So people will say, I want to go back to school, but uh, if I, I can't afford it or I don't have the time or if I go back to school, I'm not going to be able to do da, da, da. Um, all of these things, they never think about, well, if I start school today, a year from now, I could be halfway done. Or if I start school today, four years from now, I could be living a life that I really want to live. And it can make such a profound impact on me that it would be the greatest thing I've ever done in my life. So if you're always looking at all the bad things that may happen from a changeable situation, you're never going to get to the good stuff. And like I said, I'm not saying that making a change necessarily means it's going to be positive. Like I said, things could get worse when you make a change. But as long as you're moving, you'll eventually get to where you want to be, whether it's relationships, whether it's finances, whether it's education, um, you know, whether it's your own fitness or whatever the case is. Uh, if you are unhappy with the current situation, just make a change and take action. The result, you'll constantly keep moving and moving and moving eventually you'll get to where you want to be. All right, you guys. So if you're into reading, I highly recommend this book. Um, this is a, like an updated version. So it'll kind of talk about uh, some of the, the readings in it. And then it'll break it down where it's a little bit easier to understand. I didn't know it was like that when I, uh, when I first bought it. But um, really good book. Again, Outwitting the Devil, Napoleon Hill. Check it out. Uh, if you have any questions, obviously, about health or wellness, uh, you can come check us out at CrossFit Ocala. If you like uh, these videos that you see, please be sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep up with everything. Follow us on Facebook. All right, you guys, have a wonderful day. Happy single to mile. Everybody, we'll see you soon. Have a good one.